how to use the three nodes. We will wait for app to open. So once you land up on this dashboard, you can see all the options here. You will find promotion banners here. You will find all the categories you can which you can see, and the feeds are there. You can also how our app works, and uh, to see the three D notes, you can go in this category called three D notes, right? You click on it. So you can see all the list of three D notes, whatever we have in these notes. We have some of the PDFs as well, some of the three D notes. So we can go and see uh, one of the three D notes. Is one of the three D notes which is called complete flower. female reproduction so we can open this the 3d note is loading right now okay so as you can see this is the main uh, screen of the 3d note there are multiple tools which you can utilize while using the 3d notes there's a button to go uh, next to the next slide and come back to the previous one or you can directly open the slider window over here where you can find all find all the list of notes right and you can directly switch between the uh, slides okay so we'll go to the next slide So the model is loading right now. So our first slide is of uh, plant reproductive system. So you can rotate around this model. You can zoom out. You can see all the touch points. I mean, all the labels which are there. You click on one label. You'll find a description about it. Like this label is active right now. And if you want to have a audio uh, interaction, you can click on this button. color and protective in function yeah so what you can do next is you can click on you can click on separate labels or you can just click on next button right over there and it will take you to the particular label whatever is placed there right now we can close this window okay so now if you want to turn off all the 3d labels what you can do you click on this button all the labels are gone now we have multiple tools here one is pen tool where you can go and write something upon it and uh, you can change the color from here you can change the size from here uh the size of the pen uh, whatever you're using right you can reset this i mean you can clear out the window now we will switch to the next tool this is called 3d object interaction tool okay so the first tool which is selected over here is called drag right so what you can do you click upon any of the item like this petal over here and you can drag it you rotate it and you can drag it up similarly we have a tool for slicing out the items from the model like i want to slice out all the petals from there so i can do click upon it after selecting the tool see all the petals are gone now so if you want to reset the reset all the items in the window you can click on this reset button so all the slicer right sliced items are reset now if you want to reposition all the items to their actual position you can click upon this button it will reposition the next tool is called isolation tool and isolation will keep only the item which you have selected and will remove other items from the window for example see all the items are gone from the window uh, right then we have the next button which next tool which is called uh, highlighter tool and you can select any color of your choice for example i selected this one just set it and you can color that particular item whatever you click upon it it will color it for you now if you want to go to the next slide again you can go upon the next slide it will load the model again because the next slide itself is a 3d model yeah we have all the functions whatever i explained in the uh, previous slide we have all the functions here now if you open this slider window you will find there are multiple content right i mean there are some of them are slides some of them are 3d so uh, as you can see this slide is a handwritten pdf uh, and uh, this this complete notes is a combination of slides uh, 3d models and sometimes we'll have simulations videos and all other multiple contents so this is a complete set of note where you will find multiple type of content where you can interact where you can write and you can do many things and if we are on a 3d model for example on this one and you want to make it auto rotate you click upon this button it will keep on rotating for you